Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Black <laughs> My niece is over, so we're going to get screaming from the other room. <sighs> anyway, hello. I have no spoilers whatsoever. Um, the thing that I'm most excited for uh, is what I've seen. I've seen before is the um, you get villain gear like uh, Lissandra's visor, Gates' lens, etc. Uh, I think those were the only two we saw. Well, Rose's hairstyle, but... And I think his full outfit. But, you know you, you know what I mean. God, I hope those are available for the girl characters, too. Because they, they're really weird about it. It's not like Animal Crossing, where you can just do whatever. But, yeah. Okay, let's see here. Hello, everyone. I'm Ishihara from the Pokemon Company. Hello, Ishihara. Today information on the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield games. Cool, cool. First, let's hear more about the Pokemon Sword expansion and Shield expansion. Please have a look at this trailer. Because you know those are what I'd be most excited for. Okay, yeah. We know these people. <laughs> there we go. Is that our first look at... Oh, ooh, translucent wings. Nice. Are those Avalug in the water? <laughs> Oh yeah, Calibrex or whatever it's called. Yes, yes, I would like to enter a Dynamax adventure. This is it like a dungeon crawler style? Nobody let Gerardon know about this place. I mean, if they were to make that movie today, he would probably be from Galar, but... Galarian Star Tournament, okay. <laughs> Brother sister team up. I love it. <laughs> oh. Alright, yes, yes. <laughs> yeah, ain't no border patrol gonna stop Giratina from entering a region. <laughs> okay, so we saw the, the lens and the visor. Are we gonna get anything else? I'm hoping for Cyrus's jacket. For God's sakes, I'd take his shoes if I have to. So what to. did you think? Let's take a closer look at the new adventures awaiting you in the Galar region's Crown Tundra. Give us villain clothes! Including Piers. Like, give us in his the collar Crown or Tundra, something. The second area, unlocked by your expansion pass, explore a snow swept expanse with new faces and nice, nice. new adventures. New faces, they tell us, giving us two characters. Uh, Peony, okay. Pokemon from the first gen. Hills and into a Pokemon den, where you'll reach depths beyond those that max raid battles have taken you to previously. Nice. But that's not all that awaits you in the Crown Tundra. Lots of legendary Pokemon call the area home, too. From past games, and it shows one of the brand new ones. It looks like your adventures in this wintry land will give you an opportunity to obtain every legendary Hi, Pokemon that's appeared in the main series of Pokemon games so far. <laughs> Many of those legendary Pokemon seem to dwell deep inside a special layer where Dynamax Pokemon are said to lurk. The same layer you can explore during Dynamax adventures. I'm always here for legendary lore. Team up with three other trainers to explore these caves. Sounds good. Battling wild Dynamax Pokemon as you make your way into the depths. That's a really interesting idea. <gasps> 
After adventuring in the Crown Tundra, you'll have the opportunity to form a dream team with some of the other trainers you've met in the Gala region for some nice. red battles in the new Galarian Star Tournament. Cool, cool. Trainers you've met in Pokemon Sword or Pokemon Shield. And Can we get a uh, perspective expansion? Passes. Melanie. M M M Menony? What is her name? The Ice Lady. And her son Gordy teaming up? These familiar friends and foes that you didn't see on your path to becoming champion. Why did you bring your microphone you with you? In the crown tundra. What is There's like an upside down R in the cloud. Part two of the expansion passes, the crown tundra, on October 22nd. All right. What's more, on November 6th, We'll be releasing all-in-one bundle versions of the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon <laughs> Shield games that include their respective expansion passes. Nice, nice. For anyone who hasn't visited the Galar region yet, this mm. will be a great opportunity to come explore. I'm assuming it's uh, and to more celebrate expensive the release then. Of the Crown Tundra, some special Pikachu are on their way to you. Oh no, not special Pikachus! Come on. To get these okay. special Pikachu for yourself. You'll need passwords that will soon be revealed in various places. Okay, well at least it's passwords and not like you can get the having to go somewhere. Special Pikachu, Pikachu right get. Now. Enjoy your ongoing adventures with your new Pikachu friends. Not likely, Next, sorry. We have some news about Pokemon Home. Okay. Or is it going to connect directly to Ghost? Well, yes! Well, thank you! Oh my god! I've been waiting for this for ages! With this link, Pokemon you've caught in Pokemon Go will be able to sell special Pokemon that can't be transferred. Why can't, um, purified ones be transferred? What's more? I hope this fixes that. Because they can't be transferred to Let's Go. open the mystery box in Pokemon Go. Opening the mystery box will cause the mythical Pokemon Meltan to appear on your map in the app. Okay. You'll also receive a mystery gift in Pokemon Home. Okay. A special Melmetal that is capable of Gigantamaxing. Holy cheese! Like hasn't been available until now. Cheese! Look at that thing. Gala region with this special Melmetal and unleash its powerful G Max move. Yeah. What's it called? We're planning to have the link between Pokemon Go and Pokemon Home all set up before the end of 2020. Oh my Please god, you should have done it right games. away! Why make people That's wait? That's all the new information about our games that we have for you today. I do have one last announcement for you, though. Is it about sleep? To help commemorate the release of the Crown Tundra, We've made a special music video for you all. Oh, this God. was a team effort between Pokemon Isn't that and stupid the brand new world song? Band, Bump of Chicken. So, I'll wrap things up for today by inviting you to have a look. Please enjoy the I want to know more about Pokemon Sleep. Come on. And I want to know more about that villain stuff. I mean, you would think that the most logical thing they would be give. Hey, it's the four boys walking on a... Drinking on train tracks. The, the legend has come true! <laughs> the legend is true! In before anyone, everyone complaining that the anime doesn't look like this. <laughs> Hi, Cynthia. They just really briefly show Iris from a distance.
<laughs> yeah, bead. <laughs> Where's with that hair? <laughs> Good seat, yeah. I'm getting manhandled by Kukui. <laughs> okay, so there's some battle uh, partners there. I love you. Yeah, they, I swear they showed Iris for like a brief second and they didn't show Alder at all. Those aren't the good seats. Bump of chicken. Well, I've heard of them. Because it's hard to forget a name like Bump of Chicken. This person's about to fall asleep. It's not the kind of image they want to give. Yeah, yeah, they fall asleep. All right, okay. Uh, cancel. Yeah, I want, I want to try to go back to the part where they show the champions. Should both Steve and Ann Wallace. The and chant there. Yeah, okay, so it's Iris's hands. But then they just cut straight to Diantha. That's really weird. And they don't show Alder at all. Yeah, they don't even show a distance shot of her. It's good to see Lily again. You know what was missing though? And I think we all know this. We only saw one boss in the whole thing and that was a brief shot of Pierce. Yeah, right there. That's it. That's the only boss we saw. We saw other bad guys, like we saw Bead there. We didn't freaking see any other boss. <laughs> oh, oh, my, 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 my. You like my ribbon, by the way? <laughs> Claire's a yeah, so it's interesting that we're getting information like new legendary lore and I think that could be useful for making me write obsession a little bit more. I haven't written a chapter in over a year. I've been working on it. It just hasn't been working, you know what I mean? Okay, but I like the idea of more legendary lore. Uh, Peony looks like a trip. Um, the, the best news is that we're finally getting some frickin' go and home connection. Because otherwise I transfer first gen Pokemon. Because I'd have to to send them from go to let's go and then send them to home and you can't transfer purified pokemon which is really stupid uh so even if i have something rare you know people are out of luck um 
Catching fully evolved starters lately has been really funny, though. <laughs> and I was able to um, trade uh, a shiny something. I think it was like a shiny coughing or something for uh, a legendary, so that was fun. But... Pardon. Yeah, still no information. We saw the lens and visor, but no information about more villain gear. I mean, come on, at least give us like Maxie's glasses and Archie's necklace, right? Ah, jeez, what would you get from Giovanni? Uh, his jacket, maybe? Uh, like I said, Cyrus's coat. Uh, his, you know, you know, you know what's funny is that it's actually, uh, and you've probably seen this in fan art before. It's actually like a vest instead of full sleeves. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that would be a really interesting uh, aspect to it, though. It would differentiate it from a jacket where it would, you know, come with a shirt underneath already. Uh, you already get Rose's outfit and his hairdo. Um, Guzma, you'd probably get his pendant. And Lusamine, what would you get? Maybe that big uh, green jewel she wears. Oh god. Lusamine's hairstyle. <laughs> Don't go out in any strong winds. You'll get kited away. <laughs> <laughs> Lusa means what are those shoes have you looked at her shoes oh my god <laughs> they're like clear it's they're weird <sighs> alright well uh, I was hoping for villain gear when we only got one frickin' boss. <laughs> you can't show a re they, they, sh they showed both Steven and Wallace, but they only showed Iris and they didn't show Alder at all. What in the world? <laughs>